Samsung just dropped some big news at the Galaxy event, and it's a mix of excitement and irony. At the event, Samsung launched the Galaxy S25 FE and the Galaxy Tab S11 series, but the real highlight for many was the One UI 8 release plan. Yes, the Android 16-based update is finally rolling out, but with a twist you probably didn't see coming. Samsung confirmed that the Galaxy S25 series will officially start getting One UI 8 updates this month, sticking to the schedule they first shared back in August. No delays, no surprises, at least on paper. Here's the spicy part. The Galaxy S25 FE actually comes pre-installed with One UI 8, along with all the flagship Galaxy AI features like Audio Eraser and Now Brief. That means the FE technically beats the original S25, S25 Plus, S25 Edge, and S25 Ultra, which launched almost six months ago to the stable update. Talk about an ironic move. Samsung seems to be playing a smart game here. By holding back updates on older flagships and giving the FE an edge, they're clearly using software as a tool to push new sales. But make no mistake, One UI 8 is a big deal. It brings major improvements to Gemini Live, Nowbar, Nowbrief, and Circle to Search, making your phone smarter, faster, and way more helpful in everyday life. These AI-powered upgrades are designed to change the way you communicate, search, and stay productive. And for the long run, the S25 FE actually wins again because it's eligible for one extra OS upgrade compared to the main S25 lineup. So here's the big question. Is Samsung rewarding early adopters? Or are they pushing us to buy the newest devices? What do you think about Samsung's strategy? Smart move or unfair to flagship users? Drop your thoughts in the comments. Don't forget to hit like, subscribe, and turn on the bell so you never miss the latest Galaxy updates.